It's a cumbersome process, grinding and snipping away at the 11,000 locks latched onto the Roberto Clemente Bridge. There's a story with this structure and there's a story for each one of these locks. Construction crews started the process today amid a multi-million dollar facelift for the more than century old structure. The locks had to go. They can damage the bridge's paint and add weight, but what's old can be new again. This looks pretty authentic. This could be 50 years old. The locks will go to Hazelwood's Industrial Arts Workshop. The nonprofit summer camp with 10 teens uses welding and engineering principles to teach art. Their executive director isn't sure what new form those locks will take. And I leave that up to the smart and talented energy of our young people to determine what the outcome will look like. He says there will be physical challenges to connect thousands of pieces of metal together, but also the sentimental and emotional responsibility that goes with representing so many different people who put locks there. The Clemente Bridge is set to reopen after all this construction late next year. Reporting over the Allegheny River, Tom Garris, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.